<laughs> there we go. Is it gone now? It's resting on the pillow. <laughs> Seems to be, yeah. It's gone? Okay, so this is the level of, of vibration absorption I need, apparently. It's gone again? Cool. Right, but the problem is now, let, let me show you, so fine, you can see the mic here, yeah? But let me show you from my perspective, my screen. So, one second. God, James. So, th this is obviously a slight problem. This is, um, you know... <laughs> <laughs> Um, Th this might this might be that? an issue, maybe. What do you guys think? So, yeah, that could be the issue. Yeah, sorry, give me a sec. Ugh, I should have planned for all this crap before the stream started. Yeah. Ugh. I tell you what, let me let me put the mic to the side. Let's hopefully, I'll break like everything. The room tour. Hang on a second. The camera has actually been moved. Yeah, I, I'll fix that. I think I've been moved. There we go. <laughs> so, is that is that better now? Is, is the audio better? Is the vibration gone? There you go. There you go. I never understand this crap. I'm like directly in front of the mic, and yet the camera is like off to the left or something. Is that better? Uh, could I just post a link on Amazon to a good mic stand that is hella cheap and can hold a Yeti? Uh, just just post it, and uh, it, even if it says deleted, I'll be able to read it. Okay. So right. Let's switch the game to Yeez 8 from in real life. So Yeez 8. So apparently, guys, there's 22 viewers already watching this game. So we've basically now almost doubled the amount of viewers for this game. Yay. Right. And $12, please. 12, <laughs> 12 viewers for this game. Yeah, let's see. Deleted link. So let's take a looky-looky. By the way, guys, I don't know if you saw under the stream. I actually do have an interactive link now to my my setup and a couple of other devices I do intend to buy. So if you want to click on that Amazon affiliate links, let me know. Twelve dollars. Is there a UK link for this? It says in product description the stand is not suitable for Blue Yeti USB microphone. Ha! <laughs> Rip. Rip. Damn it. So it's not. <laughs> we'll worry about that later, I guess. <laughs> Whoops. Hey, Rain Hero, how are you doing? Anyway, let's just start this game. Now, let's see. Audio English. Or do I want audio in Japanese? Well, uh, French. French? Okay. Confirm. Just boulangerie. Yeah. That's the only French word I know. I think it means bakery. Oh, I didn't click confirm on my. Hello, Migo. Mom. Fair enough. <laughs> I was looking at that microphone stand. Ah, oh, this is pretty. Now, I've heard that the soundtrack for this game is amazing. Falco M. Yeah. Guys, is the audio for the game fine, or do I need to make it louder? Can you hear the music clearly over my voice? <laughs> as long as it's loud enough so they can't hear you, it should be fine. Oh, yeah, is it loud enough for that? Louder? Okay. Stream is that better? I like the music already. How about now, poker? Can't believe I have to use my flipping pillow. To absorb the uh, the sound of the mic. That's good. Cool. Yeah. Anyway, new game. So, guys, what mode shall I do? Easy, normal, hard, nightmare, or inferno? 
Inferno, definitely. <laughs> Lol. Okay, so easy. For those who have difficulty with action games, a friendly mode that's easy to pick up and play. Not Either normal mode. Either you suck mode. Yeah, or you're just maybe 10. Or f not even 10, because 10 year olds are pretty good at games. Unless you're 5. Um, a standard difficulty for those who want to enjoy <clears throat> the story and action equally. Okay, hard mode. For those who desire the thrill of both action and grinding, recommended for experienced players of the E series. Nightmare. An extremely unreasonable difficulty. Only true masters stand a chance of overcoming this challenge. And then Inferno. A cruel difficulty beyond Nightmare with the following restrictions. Empty bottles are one-time use. Maximum item limit. Enemies move faster. Huh. <laughs> We're gonna do normal. I'd say Inferno sounds about right for you. Yeah. I thought hard. <laughs> do hard. <laughs> Yeah, Inferno for first fight and then rage quit, yeah. So, display <laughs> tips for loading screen during map transitions. Load times will slightly increase. Uh, no. So I don't do... Because the tips can be... They can be distracting me if it's like... Um, what's it called? Uh, what was that other game I played? Tales of. The category you set just now can be changed during the game via the options menu. Okay. That artwork is really pretty though, isn't it? So I checked on the PlayStation Network yesterday. There was about three streams of this. I'm surprised. It's, it's a really good game. It's a good game series. Anyway, even so, we all must face that moment when we realize there is a fate beyond humanity. Ken. Uh, when it happens to you, how will you react? Humanity is most beautiful when it pushes itself to its limit. Rip, I didn't read it all. So, I hope to personify this belief myself, but even now, decades later, I reverve her for doing what I could not. A doll. Apparently a doll is like a long-standing um, character. So, apparently this game is based on the idea that a bunch of people are marooned on a lost island. And you have to basically work together to get off the island. That's the story of the game. How long it takes to finish, I don't know. I'm just here for the action RPG element. The fun fighting and so on. So, Southeast Greek. The Kote Sea. Apparently, um, the Yi series has been going on just as long as Final Fantasy. It's been going on for like 30 years. Love you. Yeah. Guys, is it just me or is it slight glitching on the audio? It's like cutting in and out for a split second. Now, I was going to get this game on PC, but on, on Steam, but it's been delayed. So, rip, you can't really do anything about that. Yeah. Oh, so it did update to 12. So apparently today I've had 12 subs. So, thank you guys. I guess a lot of you renewed today. I thought that was just my side. No, no, it's, I, can, I can hear it as well. Anything I can hear, you guys probably will hear as well. Okay, so, do, do any of you guys know about the E series? No, I've heard of it. No, I've never heard of it. Okay. Are you taking a break too? Oh, there's voice acting. Nice. We got a YouTube subscribe. Yeah, there is some glitching. Fucking oh god. <laughs> the other way to do it would be if I disable the audio for the Elgato Always and then use the line in. Suffocating. So then that audio glitching shouldn't be happening. Let me, say, let me just do that because I, I, I think I'm going to rage if it keeps happening. So, okay. I muted the Elgato. Now we're going to use line in. And because the, it's like instant capture, it should be fine. Okay, so can you guys still hear it? It should be capturing it from my desktop now, not from the Elgato device. Okay, anyway, always staying inside the hold feels suffocating. Outfit looks pretty good on you. Outfit looks pretty good on you. I've been yeah. hired to load all the luggage. You've been hired as a temporary sailor. Yeah. They, like, the music is so much louder than the voice acting. They let us on board till we reach Aresia in exchange for doing a little work. Yeah. 
unless they're feeding and paying us. We're killing three birds with one stone. Okay, we need to thank the captain. We should save up while we can. You seem to be getting it. You're right. Adventuring can be expensive. Anyway, it looks like we can head to our destination as soon as we arrive in port. I do love these style of games. I really do. And there is anime to it's this kind as well. Of sad, but I guess we'll have to say farewell to Zandria. As we greet our new adventure. Yeah. I'm looking forward to it, partner. I, I, I'm looking forward to the combat. So the games to compare this to would be like Sword Art Online or Tales of, basically. So I haven't played either, so... Ah, oh, fair enough. Once we reach the port in Sunya, Greek is just up ahead. Um, anyway, the wind blows. I'm thinking about that right now. <laughs> Man, we're 20 years old now. You're still eager for adventure. I mean, 20 is young. Like, what? <laughs> it would have been better if we traveled off the western coast of Afroka. Afroka, right? Hey, are you trying to reach Altago? Hey, Cinnamon, how you doing? Long time. Hey, what's going on? Gosh, you. I wonder if the characters will be as memorable as Tales of um, the Stereo or. <laughs> Adol <laughs> has always been looking for a way to get to Altago. I'm amazed. You are aware of the conflict between the Kingdom of Altago and the Roman Empire, right? Only ships of the Roman Navy can sail into that part of the sea. You're known as an adventurer, but I didn't think you were that reckless. Well, being around him is always entertaining. The Adol that trots about finds adventure. Yeah. Want to come with us, Kashu? Why not? <laughs> I'll pass. Damn it. By the way, your break is almost over. Uh, by the way, get back to work. Dobie, can you get back to your duties in the hold? Well, it's that time already. Okay, I'll get back to work. My brain, I'm like, mother effort. See you later, Adol. <laughs> What should I do? Should I help in the hold too? No, Dogi should be able to handle everything on his own. Can you go see Captain Barbaros? Barbaros. I was told to send you to the captain's quarters once your job was finished. Cool. The captain's quarters are located at the aft part of the deck. Please. Please visit him. Okay. So now we have to go see the captain. Right. So move with the L stick. Talk with X. Search, press X when that magnifying glass appears. Okay, let's see. Evasion, hold to dash, L1. Adventure, uh, sorry, adventure gear is L2. Item screen is R2. Access skills and flash guard is R1. Switch is square. Target lock or unlock is triangle. Jump is circle. Attack is X. Camera reset R3. Camera movement R and move L. And then uh, change ally tactics, toggle mini map size. Okay. And then press <coughs> extra skill, press R1 while holding L1. Oh, okay. So, how to use downloadable content? Downloadable content will display in the item menu DLC tab. Selecting content from the list, press X to open it. Content that you open is added to your inventory. Oh yeah, you can guys, you can buy a whole bunch of like armor sets and stuff. But I wanted to play the game before I worry about things like that. Okay, so I got the trophy new adventure. Okay, so let's go see the captain. The sailor. Hello, sailor. Bearing north, northeast. Engage! Okay, which one is the captain? He's the spot. The captain wanna be 
Oh, okay, so you can just walk, you can just push yourself through doors. Oh, Adel, it's you. Thanks for coming. Why don't you take a seat first? I wonder when we'll see any actual anime. To be honest, that's all I want to see. <laughs> Now, if I remember correctly, you said you're an adventurer. Yeah. And are you aware of the Isle of Siren? No. Nope, never heard of it. No. I see. Well, there are a lot of islands in the Gaite Sea. It's famous for being difficult to navigate due to its many islands with complicated coastlines. The scariest of all is that every ship that approaches the island mysteriously sinks. Huh. That's the Isle of Siren. Okay. That's kind of concerning. Mysteriously sinks. Yes, the currents are difficult to navigate, but the cause of the sinking remains unknown. About five years ago, it's probably like the Kraken from Rom approached the island, but the ship was suddenly sucked into a calm sea. There wasn't even a reef to run aground on. The siren is a beast from Grecian mythology that sinks ships. Oh, fair enough. The pirate who named the island claimed that it is eternally cursed. So why would they want to go to a cursed island where all the ships sink? Maybe. Hmm. I didn't expect you to ask that. But unfortunately, no one in the world can answer your question. Fair enough. That's because no one who has landed there has ever returned alive. Rip. Sailors from the Gaite Sea don't even know what kind of place it is. So they don't know if there's treasure, they don't know if there's any reason to go there? I want to at least see it. I can't go near the island, but I'll let you know when we're passing by it. Cool. Looks like I sparked a flame in your adventurer's spirit. This topic is something I always bring up to new sailors. When I told Kashu, he got so scared he wouldn't even come out of his quarters. Let's see, so jumping back from my suggestion for mic stand, I wanted you to know that that model uses a normal hand mic stand, but all you have to do is remove the screwable plastic uh, piece and screw that into the Yeti, then um, the ATM into the adapter. It's the adapter that holds the hand mic stand, blah, blah, blah. Now, the thing is, uh, Zyla, Zyla, I, I don't want to buy something and then have to effectively manufacture it myself. I want it just to be plug and play, you know what I mean? I have high hopes for you. Money is not the issue. It's just like, does it do the job? Thank you very much. Yeah. It's like yesterday when I went shopping right, with my mom. To keep you this long, but she I was a like, favor to ask you. Okay. Um, she was saying, oh, you can get a discount, well. Primark discount, this shop discount, this shop. And I was just like, I want shirts which I like. I don't care about them, like, saving five pounds. Because I'm going to probably keep these clothes for the next four years, knowing me. Every time the ship takes on guests, we throw a welcome party. I want you to attend the party as security. Okay. Are there any threats? Don't worry. I'm just being cautious. As long as the guests' lives are in my hands, I want to be prepared. I do wonder if these choices I'm making have an effect later. Please talk to Kashu about the details of your duty. <laughs> duty. All right. See you later, Adam. My guys, remember, this did, game did get 8 out of 10 on GameSpot. To put in perspective, Destiny 2 got 8 out of 10. I have a look here later in the month, then when I get paid. Yeah. Good evening, everyone. I'm Captain Barbaros. I would like to take this opportunity to thank you for choosing the Lombardia for your travels. The ship is 50 milli long and has four masts. It is the largest ship of its class, and it sails between Zandria and Arisa.
Eventually I'll get into the combat, guys. I guess it's just an extended intro. Let me go over the duties of security one more time. You must Yay. secure the guest floor and the top deck. Just make sure no one does anything threatening or suspicious. Is someone being threatening? How long am I supposed to look around? Hmm, let's see. Can you look around until I tell you it's okay? If there are any interesting guests, go ahead and talk to them. Well, no matter who you're talking to, they're a guest, so be respectful. Aye aye, sir. Someone's on board. Alright, the captain's greeting is about to end. I'll start right away by looking around the hold. See you later, adult. Yeah. It's mostly kind of like, say what you, they want to hear, and so they leave you alone to get on with your job. That will do for me. Everyone, please enjoy the rest of the evening and feel free to chat with me. Please have a wonderful night. Okay, interesting. Right, camp menu. Save and load. Accessible from the system via thing. Press the options button while the camp menu is open. Aha, uh -huh. okay. Camp. <laughs> camp. Right, so... And it's auto-saving, which is good news. Let's talk right here. Let's just go to the girl, shall we? Hmm. Seems like we eat while standing. I assume it means we can eat all we want. All right, I'm going to eat, eat, eat until it matches the ticket price. I mean, you can eat her as well. Sir, sure. I mean, look how flipping like fong or g-string. Anyway, <laughs> let's ignore that. Let's talk to this dude. So, looking around, you can tell that all kinds of walks of life are on the Lombardia. Different social status and outfits. This ship has an accepting heart. Okay, so it accepts, like, sluts and cultured people at the same time. I'm old. It's been uh, worth living for such a long time because I was able to ride a ship this beautiful. The feud is delicious and I have nothing bad to say. Okay, let's talk to this dude. So, cheers to a wonderful night. Ha 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 ha, what a tasty red blend. Is he drinking your blood? Drinking after a hard day's work is great. Cool. Next, who's this girly? So, I was able to enjoy a very thrilling time aboard. Abroad, sorry. And I got this ticket for a marvellous ship. I'm one lucky Eresian woman. Okay. Let's talk to him. I was nervous about travelling across the sea, but I'm really glad that my wife... So, sorry, to see my wife happy like this. This bliss, I hope it lasts forever. Wife, eh? Oh, I'm abusing your wife. Oh, I'm kidding. Anyway, moving on. Well, how are you? So, it's not that bad joining a feast with commoners, after all. Oh, high class, is she? Yeah. It's not a she, it's a he. Well-dressed man. Oh, wow. Lol. Fail. Rip. Kappa. This abnormal combination comprises the ingredients for a masterpiece. Hey, Domenio, how you doing? Why would a man have that style of hair? Lombardia, not too shabby. And he's, it looks like he's wearing a dress. Maybe he's gay. I suppose. Okay, do we... We haven't spoken to her, have we? There weren't any other ships available, so I boarded this one. I feel really bad for my family. This isn't my Atoma or anything, but when I get back, I'll try to recreate all the food served here for them. Um, with that settled, I need to start my culinary research. Cool. So, gen the general feeling is everyone's feeling positive about this journey. To see my lady so surprised, that was quite the treat. It's the duty of this butler to support my lady, who is not well travelled. She can be quite a handful. Okay. So, let's talk to him. To this noble looking man. Alright! Alright! Thank you for the sub, dude. I appreciate you. Hashtag Zypher, guys. Thank you, buddy. 
By the way, guys, it is 50% off subs. So if you've not subbed before, then you can get it for half price. Which means you can get a $25 sub for as little as $12. Um, hey, Sailor, what are you just standing there for? Bring me a delicious feast. Oh, no, sorry. Noble guy. Hey, uh, Sailor, what are you just standing there for? Bring me a delicious feast. Uh. I was told that this is a large passenger ship, but his lack of class is obvious. Uh. Okay. Let's talk to him. <laughs> I think you already know that the drinks are for passengers only. But leftover drinks are very, very different story. But when our shi shift is up, let's drink like we always do. Cool. Next. Yeah. Let's see, patrol duty, huh? It doesn't happen often, but we sometimes have stowaways. Well, be careful. Right, so I've spoken... Ooh. So, adults who get excited over a party are idiots. Ah, I'm getting bored and sleepy. I should check out the hold. Fair enough. So, traps are in. Hang on. Traps are real in ease. Yep. Thank you for the one bit, dude. It's good that I got on board, but damn, where could they be? If I'd known that this was going to happen, I would have picked up a rendezvous beforehand. Okay, I think we've spoken to everyone, right? Okay, so shall I? Let's actually go outside now. Okay. So it looks like you're patrolling. Don't tell me you got lost. This is the tail end of the ship. The hall and the captain's room are over there. If you want to go to the hall, use the stairs at the front of the ship. Okay. So I'm patrolling. Let's see if we can find any items or just rob the guests while we're here. Sounds fun. Yeah. So... Does anyone have anything secret that they don't want to declare? Let's see... Oh, it is quite a big ship. Okay. What's up? So, hey, it doesn't seem like you have to pull kitchen duty while you're patrolling. Perfect timing, then. I wonder if, because it said main over his head, that means, like, main quest. I mean, aren't you just trying to decide where to go for your next adventure? This ship is gigantic, so I figured we could ask around to hear some interesting stories. If all goes well, we might be able to pick our next destination. Huh. If you hear anything interesting, tell me later. Cool. That's done. Okay. So there's no items just yet for us to find. Now let's go through... We went into all the rooms, right? I think we did. I'm just being thorough in my investigation. Okay, what's in the hold of the ship? A dude. A big hole. A yes. sailor. So, oh, this is the third class cabin. We stay here too. Oh, it's you, adult. I heard you're on patrol duty. How's that working out for you? Well, when you finish your rounds, uh, you're done for the day. Let's keep at it. Okay. Oh, wow, we can go even further down. Interesting. You might be able to find a seaman. Yeah. Let's see. Anything? Oh, by the way, guys, uh, I f completely forgot. I pre-ordered the Destiny 2 Collector's Edition guide. It arrived a couple of days ago. <laughs> Whoopsie. Whoops. <laughs> Let's talk to the cow, shall we? Boo. Okay. Let's talk to this sailor. Oh, Kashu. What's he concerned about? Seems to be no issues, no problematic passengers either. Problems are likely to happen on the day of departure. Well, I don't think there will be issues, but please patrol the ship anyway. Okie pokey. <laughs> Let's talk to... So we can talk to the animals. Okay, timid man. Ah, we finally departed. Boarding this wasn't in my plans. Maybe I should have turned them down. 
Not like I can hop off midway. Ah, um, I hope I don't have to do anything too demanding. Okay. Anything. Anything at all. Give me treasure. <laughs> I guess I'm just so used to, like, you know, Final Fantasy, you just find treasures everywhere. From Kingdom Hearts and so on. But it's nice, though. The game is running at 1080p 60fps, which is good news. It's like for once. Let's go up. I do wonder when the next Tales of game is going to come out. I just hope they do a better job with the dialogue. Okay, changes minimap size, displays full map screen was down. Okay. So, character search point, treasure chest, last past entry, food, wood, ingredients, plant, and ore. Main story, quest, quest, and other events. Okay, so yellow is the main story, blue is normal quest, green is other. Okay. Remember the person here? The real warrior talks at night when it's difficult to navigate. The main hall is hosting a party, but let's keep on our toes. Glad to have you with us, adult. Cool. Now, I'm going to assume that we have a fight soon. Because that's Nobody usually how these stronger. quests go. Yes. That's you, adult. Thank you for patrolling at night. The stars are beautiful, huh? Uh, don't gaze up at them too long and stumble off the deck. Check our course! Set sail! Okay. So, before we carry on the main story quest, let me just check the other end of the ship just to see if there's any anything else. So, Dignified Woman. Ah, this breeze feels good. It's so different from the tainted air of Rom. Ah, she's pretty. So, it looks like you use a sword, but never mind. Wink. That's, it's such a calm and quiet night. I shouldn't bring up such boorish things. Is this PlayStation 4 exclusive? No. It will be coming out on um, Steam as well. But uh, they delayed the Steam release because they wanted to make sure this done right. But it, it works perfectly on PlayStation, so if you don't have a PlayStation, fine, get a PC one, but the PlayStation 4 one, it seems, works perfectly. Working the night shift is tough. I want it to be over already. And the thing is as well, fine, you know, PCs are a lot more powerful than PlayStation. But these sort of graphics... Needs to be an honored guest room. Let's not go in there. Okay. Um, these sort of graphics, it doesn't matter if it's 4K resolution. It won't make it that much, It won't make any better, if you know what I mean. The texture quality is quite low. Okay, let's talk to the captain. It'll be a few days before we reach our next destination. Uh, so Union Port. I would like to listen to your adventures when we have time. For now, I'll patrol the ship. Sir, yes, sir. You hear a voice from the captain's quarters. Um, ooh, this is... I found something nice. Now I'm officially part of the crew. Enter the captain's quarters. Okay. Hey, yes, sir. Hey, yes, sir. We're on Discord if you want to join us. Oh, it's a little girl. So, oh, it's you. You're the one, right? The new sailor? You may not know it, but despite my looks, I'm a seasoned sailor. Okay. Alright, I'm gonna report to the captain. Why don't you clean a room or something? <laughs> okay. Nice. You're very obedient. Bye. Okay. <laughs> so the girl's footsteps disappear in the distance. She seems to be gone. Okay. So let's just rob the captain while we're here. Okay, he's successfully oh, robbed. Everybody does that. Yeah. So let's see if there's anything at this end of the ship. Nope. Okay. So we've done everything of everything. So let's carry on the main story. I don't think there's anything left we could possibly do. What do you guys think of the music, by the way? 
Aha, the breeze feels nice. Great weather and a clear, starry sky. Wait for me, beloved Crete. I'm coming home. Cool. Right. So now... Hang on. Uh... Okay, so I, I finished patrolling the ship, so shall I just go back to the hall? Yeah. So I have to. It's not really a choice. Um, at least the minimap, like, says exactly where to go. <laughs> a man in black. What do you want? Uh, zip. I'm confused. You look suspicious. Um, yeah, you look suspicious. Is, is that what you say to someone you're investigating? Yes. <laughs> no denying that. You know that I don't respect anyone who enters someone's room without permission. If you don't have any business, then get out of here. And try not to slam the door when you close it. Okay. <laughs> I walked into a wall. <laughs> Lol. Okay, so let's carry on. Let's talk to a lady. No. Oh, why did he have to be on the ship? Jeez, always treating me like a helpless child. Okay. Cutscene. Are we done? Hey, Adol, how are you doing on lookout? No problem at all. Everyone looks suspicious. <laughs> I see, that's good. Well, there are a lot of unique guests on board. The ocean is calm again today, and the ship is sailing smoothly. By the way, the captain was looking for you just now. I think he said something about passing through something soon. He should be back in the captain's quarters by now. Why don't you go visit him? I'll go right away. Okay, I'll look around for a bit longer. Cool. So I need to go back to the captain. So let's do it. So by captain, that means climb stairs. Go back onto the, the deck. So that sort of remind me later to show you my new suit, yeah? That I bought. I've already showed everyone else. Ah, I went to the wrong end of the ship. Damn it! Oh, so you can like forward roll. Can I run? Okay. Let, let, let me just practice all the buttons. DLC. Okay, so I haven't, I haven't downloaded any DLC yet. Adventure Journal. Okay. Okay, so jump is square. Okay, so you can jump, but you can't jump like over edges or anything. It's not interactive like that. Oh, here you are. I'm sorry to bother you while you're working. Nothing important, I just wanted to let you know we're about to pass the area. Is it the... Um, hmm, that's right, the Isle of Siren. We were just talking about it. The weather is great today, so you might be able to see the uh, silhouette of the island. The Isle of Siren is about 500 square Krimail. At the center, there is a range of mountains that are about 2,000 miles high. We're about to pass by. I figured you'd want to see it. Oh, by the way, guys, there is actually already a collector's edition of Nino Kuni 2 available on sale. It's 160 quid, and but it comes out in January, so you have time to save if you want to get it. I love, love you. you know, really, really looking. So in January, hopefully, guys, we'll be playing Nino Kuni What's too. going on? I don't know, but it seems like we crashed into something. That's impossible. There's nothing to run into in this area. Have you seen the combat yet? No, not yet. Check it out right away. I'm assuming we're gonna we're about to because we just crashed hey, into sir. something. It seems like the typical <sighs> RPG, let's learn how to fight situation. We're still some distance from the island. What could it be? Ah! 
<laughs> what is that? Huh? What was that? This is very different to Yi's origin. Were any of you guys here when I played Yi's origin? I think so. This is back when I was streaming on YouTube. No, oh, it's not. What is that thing? It looks like a tentacle. Is it gonna like pull the ship down? It's a Kraken! Yep. We're being attacked by the Kraken. I was. Yeah. So let's see what the combat's like. But they said one of the, the reasons this game series gets praise is because it does reinvent itself. So it's not just gonna follow the same thing over and over again. Okay. We have a fight, I assume. Like, what did I do to you? <laughs> Giant tentacle. Good structure hard mode. Yeah. At all. Take this. <laughs> Take this. You guys are gonna impaled with it. But I got the the Isis blade. Are you taking the piss? Okay. Nice one to follow. Appreciate you. Okay, so X to attack, triangle to lock onto a target, camera will follow the enemy, enemy information and weaknesses will display, change the targets with R, and triangle to unlock. Okay. Okay, evade enemy attacks with L1, use it to dodge dangerous attacks. So we're practicing how to dodge. Come on in. Circle to jump. Uh, press X while jumping to attack. A strike while ascending or descending to perform different attack. Okay. Laser if we attack him and it's about to attack us. Are we done? Okay. We won. Yay, well first. Not really. No. Oh, Ooh. Good. Whoa, you're so cool. Thanks, babe. You're really great, sailor. Thank you. Great job. Can always count on you, Adol. Yeah, is it going to reveal the, like, 50 other tentacles? What's that thing? This looks good. Yeah, yeah, the combat in these that games is like really, really fun. A giant squid or something. As I absolutely hey. love these Origins. It's one of the mods. If you go to Mifri.com, guys, you can see my full playthrough of these Origin, if you want to check it out at some point. Okay, now there's like six of them. What's going on? Rip. Thanks, Bogger. I think that's what, uh, how part of the reason this game is scored so highly is because of like it's just really, really fun to play. Gonna end up on the island, obviously. Seems like a foregone conclusion. Help me! 
No, it's not going to help you. You're arrogant. Whoa. That was a little kid, though. Nice. Are you serious? Damn it! Rip. So the point is, the ship is rip. You guys agree? Oh, so I have to look at that. Yeah. Oh, anime. Wow, it's two moons. It's so pretty. Okay, you're watching. Yeah. Theme is good, right? So guys, it might look jittery like on the screen, but that's exactly what I'm seeing on the PlayStation as well. The anime itself is just jittery for some reason. This is a way of saying that, yeah, you're going to enjoy this game. to fight dragons as well. I guess we saw it. What the uh, Kraken thing it looks like. Alright. Okay, chapter one. The Isle of Siren. We'll see if I enjoy this more than uh, Tales of. So what did he say? So it's a Siren Song C, isn't it? Yeah. Level 61 dungeon. <laughs> yeah. It's all RPG, they're all the same game, let's be honest. Pretty much. Where am I? Looks like I washed ashore somewhere. <laughs> Sorry, too much seawater. There's no sign of people. The sound of waves crashing is the only thing that is echoing in my ears. This is the voice of his inner conscious, by the way. Ooh. Hello. So we got the trophy, Night on the Great Sea. Wow. So, there's fishing in this game, by the way. Oh god, not again. If you guys care. <laughs> Another thing not to level. Let's search the shore <laughs> a little more. Okay, so we can't go too far this way. Ooh, okay. Let's get our sword. 
Did this wash up on the shore? An old sword sticking up from the ground. Would you like to take it? Yes. So you picked up the rusted sword and equipped it. So I'm, I'm going to assume that, you know, we were doing like 400 per attack. Oh. So yeah. So ra yeah, rather than try and be friends, let's just attack all of them. I got a new skill. That was easy. So I don't acquire the new skill during the bout. So skills are unleashed by using SP. Skills are learned through battle. Uh, set them via the uh, skill from the camp menu to R1 plus a button. Okay. Fair enough. Fair enough. So gain SP by attacking. Land a charge attack to gain a lot of SP. Normal attack. If you stop attacking, your power will charge. Press X for a charge attack. You gain massive SP. Uh, if you stop attacking all the power, your power will charge. Okay. Hold R1 and press any other things to unleash a set of a skill. Okay, so I have to assign it though. You have to be on guard from now on. You should set your skills just in case. Okay. So skills menu. Let's set it to circle, I guess. Sonic slide. So it says rushes the enemy and delivers a quick slice. Okay. I like the menus. Menus are cool. So we've been adrift so long, your body is exhausted. It's dangerous to stay here. You should get going. I do wonder if, um, like, if doing this on the Inferno difficulty, like, that fight you'll just lose. Or it'll be really hard to do. Big Tree is blocking the path. It doesn't seem like it will budge. Oh, I love the music. Okay, nice. So there isn't any crap. There isn't any weird like fight ignition or anything like that. The fight just starts. You can just run and slash and attack them straight away, which is good news. Okay, look, this is the fishing holes I was telling you about, but we'll get back to that later. Okay, cool. Let's carry on. Because if anything, the sort of like screen shattering or a slight delay before combat starts is actually really annoying. So I'm happy they also got rid of that Final Fantasy 15. So I don't quenched his first with the clear water from the river. He felt the water sinking into his body. He felt quite relieved. So stand still while out on the field to gradually recover HP. Okay. You will not recover inside dungeons, so bring medicine. Makes sense. Okay. Should we keep going? No. End of screen. Okay, bye. Okay, anything? Yeah, more fishing holes. So I said, we can see fishing holes all over the place, but don't have to worry about that yet. You can jump over there, like swipe attack. Okay, I got a thin hide. What's this? Okay, it looks like a plant I could have gathered, but apparently not. There we are. Rip. So far, so good. And items that are dropped on. Um, so basically, this is like Yi's origin, but from a much closer angle, which is great. Oh, crap. Rip. Okay, the item. Rip. 
Ah. Okay. So you can actually cut these uh, fruits off the trees. Okay, so if I stand still, I recover health, right? Yeah, that's what I said. Yeah, yeah. So you can see the bottom right of the screen, you can see the health bar, like, flying up. So, cool. Okay, let's carry on. This way. Is these Origins worth playing? I would say it is, yeah. Very, very fun. I finished the whole game. It's very challenging. It was a little bit frustrating at a point, but it was good. But, naked Who lady. Ooh. Ooh. Oh, she's got ball for a ball. Is it going to be like Zoro? Just like starts slashing at her cloak? Her whoops. Her nudity. It's a red mage. <laughs> <laughs> Was that a slap that I just got? <laughs> Sorry, we just got up to the naked lady part. <laughs> the bar rope. <laughs> Why are men always, eh? Tactless, and on top of that, so pushy. Yes, just like him. Oh. Oh, that's the best first impression ever. I apologize for making you wait. <laughs> that ass. So, Laxia, Laxia. Let us introduce ourselves first. So, yeah, My well, before the sex, you mean. I'm a daughter of the noble Roswell family from Garmin. The ship I was on sank, and I drifted to shore near here. Fair enough. Who are you? From the look of your clothes, you must be a sailor from the Lombardia. I'm a doll. I'm actually an adventurer. Oh, Chris. An adventurer? Don't try to fool me. I almost lost my life in that accident. Fair enough. As part of the crew of that ship, you need to explain to me what happened. Tell about the legend of Isla Siren. Tell her about the giant tentacles that attacked. So I told her about the giant tentacles that attacked the Lombardia. You said your name was Adol, correct? So you're telling me that those giant tentacles attacked and destroyed our ship? Yep. Do you expect me to believe such a bizarre story? How she doesn't believe anything, does she? You think I am? Oh, you? Agent Five Force, how you doing? Is it just me? You kind of look like. Huh? Whoa. Do we have a boss on our hands? Well, she might boss you around a bit. Yeah. Well, not really, it's just four mobs. When did they? Oh, so I are we going to practice party play now? <laughs> Leave us to me. There's no need for that. I don't need protection from someone like you. Well, she's got balls. Let's see about like Rothwell entering the fray. Right, allies have attributes that will deal critical damage to vulnerable enemies. Slash is effective against soft-bodied enemies. Pierce is against aerial enemies. Strike effective against armored enemies. Full compatibility means poor damage output. Okay. Pierce, slash and pierce. Okay. So, attack with effective attributes to break opponents. High damage plus lowest defense is slash. Damage plus lowest defense is round fire strike. Damage.